play Joyful by X Ambassadors. We're in standard tuning. There's no capo. We have an E chord, an A chord, and an F sharp major chord. If you know how to play those chords, please skip ahead. If you don't, we're going to go over those real briefly here. <coughs> For an E chord, your index is on the G string on the first fret. So that's the third string up. One, two, three. And the first fret is all the way at the end of the fretboard over here. Middle finger is going to be on the second fret of the A string, which is your second string down. One, two. And your ring finger gets tucked right under on the second fret of the D string. You need to play all six strings for that chord. For your A chord, your middle finger is going to go on the third string down, second fret. That's your D string. Ring finger is going to go on the second fret of the G, tucked right under that middle finger. And your pinky is going to tuck right under your ring finger on the second fret of the B string. And you're going to play from the A string down, so you're playing all the strings except for your high or your low E string here, this topmost E string. <clears throat> and finally, for your F sharp chord, this is a bar chord, but if you're a beginner, don't worry, I'll teach you how to play it as an open chord here as well. You're going to bar your second fret with your index finger, all six strings. Middle finger is going to be on the, let's see, what is that, the third fret of the G, which is your third string up again. Ring finger is going to be on the fourth fret of the A, and your pinky is tucked under on the fourth fret of the D string. If you're a beginner and it's difficult to bar, go ahead and lift that index finger up and just put him on the second fret of the low E string, your top string there, and just play these top strings. Don't play those bottom two strings. And those are the strings we need. So we have an A chord, an E chord, and an F sharp chord. If you know how to play those chords now, we can move into the progression. So our progression starts on an E. Goes to an A, back to an E, to an F sharp, A, 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 back to E. And our strumming is going like this, down, down, With one exception, when we're on the A chord at the end, we go down, 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 D, and then we go to our E. We'll talk about that in a second here. So we're going to do our E strumming pattern for two. So one, two, A for one, E for one, F sharp for one. slowly here. Down, down, up, down, up, down, down, up, down, up. And that progression is played throughout the entire song. So if you know how to play that, you can play the entire song. That is going to be it for this tutorial. If you have questions, comment below. If you'd like to see more tutorials, please subscribe to my channel. I would really appreciate that. Thank you for watching.